People who live in glass houses shouldn't throw stones. Often, it's those people who throw stones at others are ones who are hiding something. And I've heard it before, and I experienced this in my own life. You are what you hide. And often those people who hide, who are hiding the most are throwing the biggest stones. And what I've discovered in the human condition is that nobody is perfect. No, not one, not one person is perfect on this planet. That means nobody has the right to throw a stone at anybody. And anybody who is throwing stones at other people actually deserve to have a stone be thrown at them. But because nobody deserves a stone to be thrown at them, everybody should put their stones down. Everybody sins differently. Everybody is on a path in life and going through what they're going through. And it's be very careful because just because somebody's in a season of imperfection, a season of sin, you never want to judge people by that one snapshot that you can take at, at them in that part of their life when they don't have it all together, when they're making some mistakes and maybe they're even failing and falling flat on their face. Don't judge them by that one season or that one chapter because they're eventually going to get out of that season. Eventually a new chapter is going to be told about them and be written about their life. So give them the grace that you are going to need when you go through what you're going to go through in life. Maybe you cause it, maybe somebody else causes it. But I would extend, if I were you, the same grace to the people around you that you will need in your life. Everybody is going to go through a season that they're going to need grace. And what I discovered in life, it's those people that need grace and they know they need grace that give away grace more and more to the people around them because one day they realize life is going to be outside of their control things are going to happen life often doesn't console us and in our calendar doesn't synchronize with those times in life that we uh, don't want to happen and they're going to go through something and they're going to need grace as bad as they're going to need to give it away so they give it away to the people around them accepting somebody in their mess accepting somebody in the midst of their failure doesn't mean you approve of what they're going through but it means that you love them sincerely with no strings attached and you can help them get through what they're going through. You are not in control of their season. You are not in control of their circumstances and situation, but you are there to love and help and guide and direct and help them overcome what is overcoming them. Help them succeed in a season of failure because here's the reality. You can't judge them. You can't control their season. I can't judge them. I can't control their season. I can't control their circumstances, nor should I be judging them. Only God can judge someone. You are, and I will not be standing with somebody before God. So we need to remember that we do not have the right or authority to judge anybody. We allow God to judge them because, and I allow, and I know with my life that only I will there, be there to stand with God. And he is the only one that I need to please with my life. He is the only one that I need to allow to direct me and guide me no matter what circumstances I find myself in. Only God can judge you. Only God can judge me. So be very careful standing in judgment over people based on their circumstances and situations that they've they found themselves in, they created, or other people created for them because only God can judge them. Why not today you give people the grace that you need, even today, based on those things that nobody knows about you. You're gonna need grace one day for those circumstances and situations that you are hiding by throwing stones. How about today you make a decision to show that the grace that you were gonna need to somebody else today, or you need grace and you know it, and you're not trying to hide it. 
and you know you're not perfect and you're not trying to judge somebody else, how about today you show grace um, extravagantly, ridiculously, crazy grace and love to the people around you or maybe you need to get some grace in your life and you've been rebellious, you've been prideful, you've been throwing stones at people, you got a pocket full of stones ready to throw at somebody on Facebook, how about today you tell somebody and you just uncover what has been hidden in your life and you find that love and that grace and that support so that you can overcome what is going to overcome you.